Hi guys, I wanted to do one last video for the evening. Um, somebody saw my haul video for the items that I had purchased at your scrapbook supply and asked me to do a demo of the inks and give me give them a review. So what you're seeing is this dollar uh, fifty stamp or two dollar stamp that I got at Michael's, sorry. Um, and I've turned off the autofocus on my camera just so I could do this video. Um, the best way I can describe this metallic ink is um, yes, it's very juicy like the other Prima chalk edger inks. Um, it's almost like you had a regular ink and you put the Wink of Stella over it. That's the effect that it kind of gives. So it is metallic and you're probably not going to see it very well on the um, video. But I'm going to try and get some of that glimmer in there. So you can see this one right here that I'm pointing at the second one in the middle you can see the glare hitting the shimmer on it and that is the metallic sheen that you're seeing so um, just to run through the colors what I did do is some of these I did second generation stamping underneath it right down here so that's why it's lighter because it was the second stamping of the same um, inked up pad so this first one is the lead color and then this one is the carbon, so you can see them next to each other. I'm see if I can point to you. Um, I'm doing this upside down. This is the carbon right here, and this one is the lead. So there's a slight variance in the color, and you can see the second generation stamping of the carbon. And then we have this one right here is the silver, so it's the lightest of the three. And then here's the second generation stamping of that. And there is still some shimmer in this. You just may not be able to see it on camera. Um, this is platinum right here. And I'm off camera here. This is the platinum one. And you can see down below there's a second generation stamping of that. This one is bronze. Um, and you can, you can see some of the shimmer coming through on there. See that? It's really pretty, the color. I'm very happy with this ink. I am glad that I purchased the other metallics that should be coming in hopefully soon. Um, I let them know that that wasn't in my package. Um, this one is the copper right here. I actually got mixed up and stamped the same one again. So this is the bronze again. And then this is the copper next to it. And these are all, um, all first generation right here. So you can see the difference between the copper and the bronze. Um, and again, there is shimmer in it. It, it looks like you used Wink of Stella over this ink. This one is called yellow. Okay. And this right next to it is the second generation stamping of the yellow. It actually looks gold to me, but that's just my opinion. The gold is right here. So let me see if I can get them all in, in view. So this is the first generation stamping of the yellow. And here's the gold. This is gold right here. And you can see the label I put down there. Um, this just looks really yellow to me. So I don't even know what to think of that. But um, each one of these does have its own shimmer. And like I said, I would I would definitely recommend these if you, if you like the metallic inks. I actually like this better than any of the... Um, See, I bought Versamark ink pads um, in the metallic, and let me see what else. I brought the, sorry, the Brilliance, the Sukuniko Brilliance, and some other um, brand, and I didn't like those very much. I like the Stays On the best um, out of all of the metallic inks I've had so far. This, to me, is, is nice, too. And the reason I say that is because I don't actually use the um, stays on ink in the pad. I always uh, use a dauber with it. And I always put it, um, I put it directly from the bottle, the refill bottle onto my dauber. I never put it onto the pad because to me that's just a waste of ink because the pad will dry out. Um, so that's how I use my stays on ink. But this is really juicy and it's chalk ink. So it should dry much faster than... Um, than the regular, um, the stays on. Um, 
Now I just put my hand through it. Some of that does come up on my finger. You can see it, see? So um, just so, just be aware of that if you decide you're going to get this chalk ink. Chalk ink is supposed to dry faster, so um, the colors are beautiful. And what am I going to do with these? I use a punch and punch these out and use them for cards and tags and stuff. So that's the reason why I tried to put more space in between them. But um, if you have any questions, uh, leave a comment below, um, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.